Hey y'all and welcome back to the DG Outdoors channel. Today's video I have a Predator decoy review for you guys. But before we get into that, um, I started a YouTube channel. Or, yeah, of course I started a YouTube channel. Started a Facebook page under the DG Outdoors channel. Y'all run over there and check that out if you guys have Facebook. I'd love to be friends with you and talk to you. Um, I talk to Afro Sniper X all the time. Denny from the Flatbroke Air Gunners on there. Uh, Brian from our Ranch Air Gun Fun channel is on there. But, my 700 subscriber video is going to come out Saturday. I plan on using the 25 caliber hats on AirTac. Do some shooting with it uh, down at my parents on Saturday. So y'all stay tuned to that. I've got 707 subscribers right now. And I'd like to thank all of you guys for that. So, Predator Decoys. I have probably the cheapest Predator Decoy that they make. It's by a company called uh, Lucky Duck. Okay, this is the little motor thing. Runs on four AA batteries, and I've had these batteries in here forever, and these are just cheap little dollar store Acline batteries, you know, they ain't nothing. Uh, it's pretty cool. You guys can actually find this. I probably paid $15, $20 for it when I bought it a couple years ago, and I lost it, and I couldn't find it. Otherwise, it would have been in the series with all the Predator stuff that I've been doing. Still plan on doing some Predator hunting eventually, but y'all, it's pretty cool because it's got this little thing that you can extend. Okay, you just pull it up, all right, and it extends up. And what it does is this actually goes on the motor mount right here, like this, slides down. Super easy, okay? Now, this little piece right here is the little thingy, and what it does, it clips on like this, and I like this cam this angle because I don't have to stand it up and show the whole entire thing, so it's actually sitting on the ground right now. All right, but I will pick it up. And all you do, is there's an on switch right here okay and you flick it and it starts doing that and it just creates movement so to get the coyotes to come in now there is no remote to hit it or anything you literally turn it on the field and you leave it your whole entire hunt and just let it do its little thing and it actually here let's do this it should be sitting up like that it's slanted it's been packed up for a while i, I thought i lost it when I moved, but um, but literally, you guys, you guys hit the on switch and it just bips around. So, what the purpose of this is, you have a coyote coming in, he's looking for what's ever in distress, right? So, he's gonna be looking for any kind of movement, and it might give you just that last second little advantage to mix with your coyote calls to uh, bring that coyote in. And they make all kinds of predator decoys. I'm not one to go out and spend 150 bucks on a predator decoy. Um, you, they make some that come with your electronic calls. I literally found this, and I've used it a couple of times to set it down in the brush. I've actually had uh, one of my grandma's cats walk up on this while I was hunting one time and, and just kind of sneak up on it. I thought it was neat. Um, but just a short little review. If you go on Google right now and type in uh, Lucky Duck Decoys, the little critter will come up. And I think Dick Sporting Goods is having a sale for $8.99 if you guys are looking for a Predator call. Some other places have it for like $17. Bucks. Again, I think I spent like $20 on this. And literally, you can pack it up right in your bag like that. Be good to go. Set it down as low as you want to. Now, these are little fibers. Okay. These little fibers will come off all right they're just little hairs like that i mean the fibers will come off they're just it's a little fake skin to look like a rabbit or whatever i don't know but um that's my little lucky duck predator call i bought on ebay or amazon walmart.com i don't even remember that's how long ago it was um i wanted a predator decoy and this is what i picked up and it's still pretty cool and it's not very loud all right, you guys hear the little motor running in there. So, I mean, it just randomly generates the movement. Like I said, there's no remote to adjust the speeds or anything. It's literally, this is what you get right here. Um, I don't know if this is weatherproof or waterproof. I have no idea. Anytime I use it, it hasn't been raining. I try not to use it in the snow anything like that so i don't want you guys to buy it and think oh like you know what if it's super wet outside will water get into any of this 
I'm not sure I did drop it and crack the housing right there by accident. Um, but other than that, again, you know, four batteries, a little stand. You guys can uh, extend it, okay, just by literally pulling up on it right here, okay. Pulling up on it and get you a height to try to get it out of that tall grass. And there you go. So I hope you guys like this little review of the cheapest predator call or decoy that y'all can get. Stay tuned for my 700 subscriber video. I did just post a video before this called My Life in Pictures. Um, pretty much it's a picture show of different events in my life that are hunting and fishing related. And uh, I did that as a new way to make an intro for uh, my channel as an intro video. The one that I made in 2019 was backyard shooting extravaganza with all my air rifles and stuff and um i wanted a new intro video for that and i posted it on my facebook page to draw people into the channel too and kind of give my background into what i'm all about so the song i picked is for the back uh for the black top ends i love that song it's been stuck in my head for a couple of days and i wanted to make a video using that song so so i did so y'all hope y'all join me saturday when I post the video for my 700 subscriber video, I think it's going to be cool. We're going to try open sights on that bad boy. Um, and remember, like, comment, subscribe. Jesus loves you. And I will see you guys on the next one. Thanks for watching.